Well, this is my experimental banana peel water to attract flea beetles. You can see we are attracting flea beetles. They're jumping right in here and they're drowning themselves. They must like the smell. And there's some other bugs here that are jumping in too. But below that you can see, look at all the mosquito larvae. And before they hatch, I'm dumping it out. Matter of fact, I'm dumping it out right now. I'm going to be using it as fertilizer. So I didn't ask the mosquitoes to blade their eggs in this water, but uh, their mosquito larvae now is going to be fertilizing my garden along with the flea beetles. And it's important to note that the bananas will put potassium in this water, so even the banana peels are going to be working. And I'll bury those banana peels in the ground a little bit. So uh, the banana peel water and the banana peels and the mosquito larvae and the flea beetles will all be fertilizer for my garden. I got these all over the place now. This keeps working and working. Okay, thanks for watching. Look at there. And I don't see any. I have one here and I've seen some in here already. See all those little specks in there. Can I get close enough without dropping my camera? Yeah, right there. All those specks, those are all flea beetles. There might be a dozen in there already. I just put that out there this morning. So what they're doing is they're feeding on these grape leaves above. See the holes in the grape leaves? And for some reason, these banana peels in the water is attracting them to come down and, and investigate. Maybe they maybe think, think it's some type of food, I don't know. But they're drowning. Giving us some relief for these uh, grapevines. So that's good. Okay. It's going to be a pot potato experiment that I'm doing even this late in July. Uh, I'll get at that in a little while. So, thanks for watching.